conversations on that. What we want to do is create a referral market where you can refer to thousands of companies um, um, that, that need a certain expertise and you might be really good at that expertise. So again, the fees that one person could earn, you know, I don't know how much you earn uh, renting out, you know, a room in your house or, uh, you, know, you know, using your car and, 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 and helping, you know, people with mobility services, uh, but uh, I do know that average fee across our system uh, for in the, in the direct hire is approximately $20,000. Um, uh, now, of course, we would take we would take our fee, <laughs> um, but uh, uh, you would get a vast, vast uh, ma majority of that, and that for, for a lot of people, that would be extremely meaningful income. Um, and for the companies, um, they would get unbelievable expertise. They would expand their recruiter network from 20,000 recruiters to, you know, a million people, um, and how do you control a million people? Well, you need great software. You need to be able to rate everything that person does. So our system, we rate everything, submittals to acceptances to interviews to offers to hires to starts. So we have ratios on all those things, and we're tracking the diversity hiring, we, you know, just lots of big data, everything that you would expect a, a modern data-driven company to do, um, and we uh, produce that data, and that's how we will be able to run a, a, a referral network of thousands and thousands of people, but assure quality, because we're kind of rating and judging people by every action they take. And we're not gonna get people out of their comfort zones. If you're great at, 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 at recruiting um, oil field engineers in Alaska, you, know, you will only see those type of jobs and those will be the only type of places we will ask you to, um, to work on. So that's how we would grow that business. Um, and um, you know, there, there's all sorts of wonderful, you know, what, what I love about work every day is, uh, you know, every day we wake up, we find people great careers, um, and we find companies great talent, and that's an unbelievably uh, fulfilling and beneficial um, uh, work that that uh, that everyone in in our industry does. And you know, we've been, uh, you know, it's really exciting to to innovate in that area to remove the friction so that everyone can find their best career opportunity. Um, and ultimately, that's what our technology delivers. Okay, excellent. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. No, there we go. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you all for having me here to, dis to discuss our wonderful product, Computer Vault Virtual Desktop. I'm going to try to keep you all entertained for the next five minutes. I know it's been a little long. But I'm Glenn Hart, the Engagement Manager and Supply Diversity Officer at Advance. And this is? And I'm Paul Angelo, the Computer Vault Product Manager. And we're actually going to do this presentation as a demonstration live. Um, I'm connected to the, I'm connected to the MGM um, Wi-Fi, and I'm going to be the uh, like the Wizard of Oz behind the curtain here. Um, a virtual desktop is a software application running on a server that contains an entire Windows operating system. It's not just a spreadsheet. It's not just a Word document. It's the whole Windows applications. Essentially, what it does is it emulates a PC on software. So I'm going to log into my virtual desktop that I use every day to run this demonstration. So this laptop right here is the client. 
and it's connecting to a server in Marlboro, Massachusetts in our office, which is hosting the um, virtual desktop. And I'm running this PowerPoint from, from Marlboro, Massachusetts, bringing it across the internet, and uh, Glenn, why don't you take it from there? Computer Vault is a private cloud located in your office. It has similar technologies to Amazon, Google, Microsoft, Azure, but it only, it's only used by one organization, that's yours. Um, note, Advent owns the complete technology stack. However, the end user can access their virtual desktop from their office locally or remotely across the globe. So as you see in this slide, there are two components to a virtual desktop. There's the, there's the server, which is um, running in that green rack there on the right. And there's a client, which you see on the left. The client is a mini PC. This is very typical. This is what I have on my desk. Connected to a monitor, a keyboard, and mouse. And the job of the mini PC is to connect through the network to the virtual desktop, which is running on the uh, server, uh, the software running there. So those are the two components. At this point, you might be asking yourself, why use a virtual desktop over your physical PC? There's two primary reasons why you, a, a customer would want to use Computer Vault virtual desktop. Number one, and most important, is security. It stops ransomware. Let me say that again. It stops ransomware. Malware, spyware, and it protects your intellectual property. And it also costs less. Yes, it costs less. Less than buying and supporting physical PCs. So I'm going to show you one more thing before we uh, leave today, and that is a demo system that we also have in Marlboro. And I'm going to access this demo system with a browser this time instead of a software client installed on my laptop. Okay. And part of what uh, our suite of products in entails is a cybersecurity suite. I'm going to show you a live dashboard of uh, the people who are trying to attack our network right now. These are their IP addresses. And let me pull up one of the reports. And this person is coming to us from Jakarta, Indonesia. And they're trying to get into our, uh, into our system as we speak. Now, they're being blocked. Um, and what will happen is, is after they try to log in five times or more, we'll block them permanently. But we can get their IP address, their ISP, uh, and make sure that they're not a threat. So it's part of the cybersecurity suite. And the one thing I want to leave you with is, as Glenn mentioned a minute ago, the only way that you can